At the Ellesmere Canyon Trail, a team of volunteers is hard at work. Digging holes and beating soil may seem like a simple task, but for Mary Hare, it's part of a much larger mission. We don't need to put any dirt in here because the cage is right up against that. Perfect. So, All right. nice. Mary's the head coordinator of the Wildland Weed Warriors, an organization that runs entirely on the passion and hard work of volunteers. By removing weeds and planting native greenery, they're not only making the community more beautiful, but they're also providing essential habitats for local wildlife. You don't have these and you don't have the insects and you don't have the birds, you don't have the, and the whole ecosystem kind of falls apart. Wildland up there with the uh, Angeles National Forest, urban behind me with the freeway, and in between weeds. But if we can take those weeds out and make it more forest, then we have reclaimed some of the land again. With determination and a pair of gardening gloves, she's pulling weeds and planting hope. Mary imagined spaces where people no longer have to walk through an ocean of weeds, but instead along trails adorned with beautiful native flora. So when the plants get big enough and the weeds go low enough, we just walk away. And you hopefully will have a beautiful, uh, you know, piece of land there that looks like what native California chaparral should look like. The above ground cage. Reporting for Canyons News, I'm Julianne Lena. With the